Hi Special Agents, Commander G here back again with some more Special Agent training to help you with the arithmetic. First of all I want to say thank you to all you Special Agents who took the time to train on your additions last week. These are super subtractions now, let's look at all the subtractions and don't forget these are top secret tips just for you. If people aren't a Special Agent, don't tell them everything. Okay, let's go. So, arithmetic paper, let's break it down into the separate skills. Alongside lots of different additions, you will also be asked lots of different subtractions. Now, what's different about addition and subtraction? If we want to subtract, we got to count back, we got to count back, okay? The first few subtractions are usually quite easy, and as always, we just put our answer in the blue box. So, for 18, take away 8. Now, have you noticed that both of the units in the numbers are the same? So, if we've got 10s and 1s, and we take the ones all the way we are just left with the tens so in the number 18 what does the one stand for it stands for 10 so 18 take away all of the eight ones leaves us with 10 okay let's practice this skill are you ready 16 take away six so take away all the ones take away the, the ones away what does the one stand for in 16 what will we be left with 16 take away six is 10 well done what about 19 take away 9? 9. 19 is 1 10 and 9 ones. If we take away all 9 ones, what will we be left with? What does the 1 stand for in the number 19? That's right, it stands for 10 again. Well done. What about 24 take away 4? So we've got 2 10s and 4 ones. If we take away all the ones, a 0 comes along and holds the space. So what will we be left with? What does the 2 stand for in 24? That's right, it stands for 20. Well done. What about 35 take away 5? We've got 3 tens and 5 ones. If we take all 5 ones away, what will we be left with? What does the 3 stand for in 35? That's right, it stands for 30. Well done. Great job, special agents. Okay, then we've got sums that I know you can do. We do them a lot. He did these sort of sums in year one. 88 take away 4. Just put four fingers up and count backwards. And don't forget to pop your answer in the box. 84 take away 4. 87, 86, 85, 84. Great counting backwards. Well done. Let's have a little practice. 37 take away 6. And you can do it with me or you can shout out the answer. I'm here to train you, not to get you worried. If you want to just listen to how I'm working them out, that's absolutely fine too. So I've got six fingers up. I'm ready to count back. Are you going to do it with me? So 37 in our head. Then we start folding our finger down and counting back at 36. Okay, so 37, 36, 35, 34. 33, 32, 31. Super subtraction, well done. What about 19 take away 5? We need 5 fingers up, we're counting backwards from 19 5 times. 19 on your nose, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, well done. 99 take away 4. 4 fingers up, let's count backwards 4 times. 99, 98, 97, 96, 95, well done. 38 take away 5, 5 fingers up, let's count backwards. 38, 37, 36, 35, 34, 33, well done. Super subtraction special agents, great job. Okay. And then we have some subtractions that want you to use your times tables, your 10 times tables, and they want you to count back in tens. Okay, so 100 take away 10. If we count up in tens, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, we also know how to count back in tens. And this is the skill that will help you with this type of subtraction. 100, 90, 80, 70, 60, 50, 40, 30, 20, 10. So what's 100 take away 10? 100, go backwards 10, 90 is the answer. Okay, well done, let's practice. So 30 take away 10. So one finger up and count backwards in 10s from 30. 30, 20. Now if you're not sure how I got the answer, you could have done three 10s take away one 10 and you would have got two 10s and no ones and you would have still got the answer 20. What about 50 take away 10? Put one finger up and count backwards in 10s. 50, 40. Well done. And five 10s take away one 10 is four 10s and that's the same as 40. 
Now, this one says 60 take away 20. A good special agent always reads the question. So we need two fingers up now. We're going to count backwards in tens twice from 60. 60, 50, 40. Super subtraction, well done. 90 take away 30. Okay, special agents, that's three fingers up because 30 is three lots of 10. Let's get ready to count backwards from 90 three times. Are you ready? 90. 80, 70, 60. Well done. Super subtraction. Fantastic. Some sums want us to count back past a multiple of 10 because they think that will confuse you. But if you can count backwards from 100 in ones all the way to zero, I think you'll be okay. And again, we do lots of this in class. So 63 take away four. Four fingers up, we're going to count backwards from 63. You can shout the answer out or you can do it with Mrs. G. I don't mind. Whatever you think helps you more. 63, 62, 61, 60, 59. Okay, so you needed to know that 59 comes before 60 to get that answer right. Let's try some of these. 31, take away 3. Three fingers up, let's count backwards together. 31 in our heads. 30, 29, 28. Well done. 52, take away five. Five fingers up. Let's go. 52 on our heads. 51, 50. 49, 48, 47. Fantastic. What about 63, take away six? Six fingers up. Let's count backwards from 63. 63 in our heads. 62, 61, 60. 59, 58, 57. Fantastic. What about 94, take away five? Five fingers up. Let's count back from 94. 94, 93, 92, 91, 90. 89 super subtraction and I know some people beat me to those answers fantastic okay now sometimes they try and confuse you by asking you to go back in multiples of 10 but giving you some ones as well so 54 take away 20 we can do this special agents we can put two fingers up and we can count back in multiples of 10 so two fingers up 54 44 34 boom we got the answer. They can't trick us, can they, special agents? Well done. Let's try some of these. 56 take away 20. So it's going to be a something six number, okay? So two fingers up. Let's count backwards in tens. 56, 46, 36. Fantastic. Well done. 43 take away 20. 20 is two lots of 10. Two fingers up. Let's count backwards. 43, 33, 23. Super subtraction. Well done. What about 63 take away 30? A good special agent always reads the calculation. Three fingers up. Okay, 63, 53, 43, 33. Well done, guys. Okay, what about 94 take away 40? Four fingers up. Going to count backwards, 94, 84, 74, 64, 54. Super subtraction, guys. Well done. Okay, now we're getting down to the tricky ones. I don't want you to worry about these special agents. We are going to do these lots and lots and lots in class. Don't panic. Watch it. If you don't understand it, just stop. It's absolutely fine. Okay, so 59 take away 15. Now, do you remember in the additions last time... <coughs> When there is squared paper, <coughs> it's because they want you to do some working out. You might have to do two things to get the answer. Now, for 59 take away 15, we need to do 50 take away 10. That will give us our 10s, and that gives us 40. And 9 take away 5, which gives us 4. So 5 10s take away 1 10 is 4 10s. And 9 units take away 5 units is 4 units. 44. Now in class we write the letters T and U above these numbers to help us. Okay, so if we want to do 66 take away 24, we need to think about the tens first. So we've got 60, we need to do 60 take away 20 and 6 take away 2 is 4. That gives us the, t the tens. Now we need to look at the units. 6 take away 4. 6 take away 4. 6 take away 4 is 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. So the answer to 66 take away 22 is 42. Okay, well done. Now, 
This is a harder one because we can't just do that. If we look at the same number, this is the first number, 74, take away 47, there's more ones to subtract on the other side. And this is where it gets complicated. Some sub subtractions ask you to subtract tens and take away ones too. Okay, we're going to start looking at this today and we're going to dig much deeper in class, so don't worry. Okay, so this is what I would do. I would do 74, I would take the whole number and I would take away the 40 first. And 74 take away 40 is 64, 54, 44, 34. I would then take the 34 and take away the 7 from 47. And four, 34 take away 7, 7 fingers up. 34 take away 7 is 33, 32, 31, 30, 29, 28, 27. And then I would pop the answer in the box okay so let me just show you very gently this one 51 take away 23 now we can't just do five tens take away two tens we can do that but we can't take three away from one we can't do one take away three so we're going to take the whole number we're going to take away the tens first we're going to take do 51 take away 20 so two fingers up let's count backwards in tens 51 41 31 that leaves us with three tens and still one unit. We've not taken any ones away yet. Then we need to look at the number we're taking away. We need to take away 23. We've taken away the 20. Now we need to take 31 and take away the 3. So we've got 31, take away 3. Three things up, count back in ones now. 31, 30, 29, 28. And we get the answer, 28. Okay, so 62 take away 35. 2 is smaller than 5, so we're going to have to take 62 and take away the 31st. So 62 take away 3 tens. 3 fingers up, let's count backwards in tens from 62. 62, 52, 42, 32. We've got 3 tens and 2 ones okay now then we're going to take the three tens and the two ones and we're going to take away the five because we've only taken away 30 and we need to take away 35 so 32 take away five five fingers up we're going to count backwards from 32 32 31 30 29 28 27 is the answer okay guys don't worry too much these are not the last subtractions we'll be doing special agents thank you for taking the time to train at home bye for now